In today's tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to attach clothes and accessories to a character, even if they're animated. Let's get started. All right, so here we are in Blender, and today we're gonna be adding some shoes to our model here. This can pretty much apply to anything, right? Clothing, um, a cap, a hat, shoes, or anything, right? So first things first, um, you can see here, character has no shoes. Um, so we're just gonna import some shoes here. We got the armature and everything. Oh yeah, make sure your character has an armature. Okay, so I'm gonna import some shoes here that I got from Sketchfab. Okay, we're just gonna upscale it here. See, it's, it's a little too small. No, the, the, the shoe, the shoe, <laughs> not, not the model. Okay, scale it to 10. Scale it again. There we go, we got our left shoe here. Gonna rotate it a little. Okay, so first things first, we are going to select our armature here. Shift select the armature to the shoe. Control P. Oh wait, no, 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 never mind, never mind, never mind. Select the shoe first. Sorry, select the object first. Then select the armature. Sorry. Then control P. Armature deform with empty groups. So, you know, we can add it as a child. Okay, there we go. Now it's a child of the armature. Next, we're going to select our Genesis 8.1 model. The model itself, shift selects with the shoe. Then we're going to head over to weight paint okay, and make sure the object, the object is blue, not the armature. Then we're going to go to weights. There we go. So then we're going to go to by name. And just like that, you're pretty much done. Then back to object mode. And now the shoe is going to, now the object is going to stick um, to the Genesis 8.1 model as a cl clothing object or accessory or whatever. Okay, but it, you still got to, you know, make sure the position and the rotation is correct so it doesn't clip or anything. But if it does clip, you can smooth it out or just expand the size of the object. Okay, let me just position it properly. And there we go. The same thing, like this, the same thing with the other shoe. We don't need to add any modifiers because it's automatically connected. Okay, now the right shoe. And it's pretty much the same, the same thing. But as I said, you can literally apply it to um, anything like if you get an accessory from CG Trader, Sketchfab, or if you make it in another project and you want it to stick to your model, piece of clothing, anything, same thing. Same thing. Select the object, shift selected with the armature, and then, yeah, you, you, you know the process. By the way, if you find this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, 
leave a comment and after this video please go check out my patreon and my socials back to the video so i'm just gonna speed this up But in cases where the item doesn't perfectly align with the mesh, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna select the item, we're gonna go to sculpt mode, and we're simply gonna try, we're gonna go to grab, or you can just press G, right? The grab tool, and we're just gonna do this. Okay, just gonna click like that until the item perfectly aligns with the mesh because sometimes that does happen okay just gonna speed run this real quick i'll be back there we go and yeah that's pretty much it And when you're happy with it, you're just gonna go back to object mode and you're done.